Hello, everybody. It is Tuesday, February 15th. That's right, we're already halfway through this MFR. Bryce Castillo, your. Uh, right, there we go. For your, your pre show green room navigator. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to me. I'm happy to be back. Thank you, everybody, for having me back. Yeah, that's. That works. That makes sense. Uh, we're having we're having a lot of fun today. We are gonna just get you right into the green room. Let's find out what the guys are up to in the green room. Green room, can you hear me? Yeah. Hey, what's up? Yo, what's up, motherfucker? It's Bryce. Hi, I'll be in there in just a sec. Okay. Cool. Uh, well, that undercut the tension I was about to set up by saying, I wish you could be with us. Oh, I mean, I, yeah. oh no, I'm hey. sick. Oh, I'm ah, sick. You're, oh, so, oh, you're so far oh, away. No, oh, no. You just disappeared. Oh, shit. Okay. Wait, did nobody you just see on Twitter? What? Bryce died. Oh, no, that's Bruce. <laughs> Uh, hey, oh, Bruce. hey Bruce. <laughs> hey, what's up? Oh, no, Bryce is dead. <laughs> so uh, the uh, uh, nobody let me forget to tell you about how the internet went bad. And hey Brian, how'd the internet go bad? Well, no, I, I gotta what, wait. Brian? I feel like this is more. This isn't, this a, is lead a, story. This isn't a lead in story. This no, this no. is this. You, you gotta tease it out of me. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta. You gotta mm. take you to dinner. Hey gotta, fuckhead! No, no, hey, no, 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 dick shit! I didn't say bully. Hey, yeah, bully. You know what? Yeah, yeah, oh, that, yeah, you know what Brian? Teasing and bullying. We don't, no. we don't want to fucking know your story. All okay, right? now yeah. you're talking. I mean, I don't have time. So what would you like to talk about? Me and me and Brent are are, are going to are going right. to Chuck E. Cheese together. That's right. You know what? And is, we're not taking you. You can't come with you us because you won't tell us the story I'm you know that we don't want to hear. You know what is yeah. a good starting story. What is Brett texting me and making it clear? He said, "You are my favorite drug." Yes. And I was I like, I was that. like, oh, what? This what is, do you mean? You're, are, like, are you telling the show you story, telling story right now? Is that a show story? No, no. We decided this wasn't going to be a show story. Yeah. Oh, right. Okay. Oh, sorry. Okay. Continue. Sorry. I'm sorry. My bad. <laughs> <laughs> I, you know, Rosebud's I, a sled. You to, when, you, when you listen, you have to listen to the Jesus whole thing, came apparently. Oh, <laughs> uh, so, man. Sorry. What you just heard is, is Brian's uh, runway for being able to forget shit that happened in the pre-show meeting. <laughs> Growing by 50 yards. Bryce fucks up once. He goes 50 yards for the rest of us. <laughs> we, we were, we, we, when, when we did our beer run, Justin reminded me of, of a phrase that, that he has held on to that uh, I forgot for five minutes. <laughs> but I'm so glad you brought back. And I think everybody should describe the situation so that it may be cemented because I think this is an important so reframe. Every once in a while. Every once in a while. Brian will start telling me a story except Excitingly, that he has definitely told me within the last 48 hours. <laughs> or possibly you were there for. Uh, yeah, or possibly I <laughs> yeah, was physically there, there for. Yeah. You uh, might be the other guy in the story. It so, was me and some other dude. <laughs> <And> so, <laughs> I reminded was, Brian, oh shit, it's like that thing that you told me about uh, uh, a couple days ago. And instead of being either embarrassed or weird about it, or defensive, Brian, or defensive, <laughs> Brian just sagely leans over to me like Obi-Wan Kenobi and says, I see you've met past Brian. <laughs> 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 and I was like, that is the most badass shit I've ever yes. seen in my entire life. Like, never have you been more in control when you didn't remember shit that you yourself said 48 hours hey, ago. Hey, hey he made Bryce it. is alive. Oh, shit, he's here. Oh, right, I'm alive. That's right. Uh, and also, that story's old. <laughs> I, no, no, so I, I, rem- I had already no, forgotten I had that to, story. Because no, he was telling me another time about how he had a one liner about mm. a thing that he forgot and I'm like don't fucking replace have you uh, I see you've met past Brian like that <laughs> yes. shit is gold oh. Oh. Uh, uh, I think I think the important trick to that is not there it is not being offended defensive or or feeling the need to shame anyone it's just you know this sly pride you know this 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 half smirking mm. like yes good job there we go okay <laughs> so where are we so at? anyway uh, Brett is a no. drug addict. I am a drug addict. You're a drug addict. Yep. I mean, 
Yes. What are you into? We're, we we hate to break it to you, Brett. Yeah. Smack uh, d- crank. This did, is an intervention. Didn't we do a whole That's like hour is. on ketamine and shit? <laughs> we talked we did about talk a lot about yeah. it. Uh, yeah. Y'all remember when uh, black heroin was the thing? Okay, yeah. stop. Uh, black, black tar, black tar heroin. heroin. First off. Okay. Well, Sorry. apparently yeah. you guys or uh, China white. Oh, I, I thought mean, you were like, talking about a rapper. Black, I don't know. black heroin. <laughs> black heroin would be the right. Good. The right direction. The wrong acceleration. <laughs> <laughs> Just, so, <laughs> so uh, Brett hits me up and uh, uh, let, uh, Thursday or Thursday, Tuesday, Tuesday that's on Tuesday. Right. Okay, last so uh, we, uh, we, the guy I was gone last week. The guys did a pre-record. We yeah. did, yeah. Um, and so and so that meant Brett and Annalisa and Corey and all. I didn't have to be here. Need to come in. Yeah. Um, black uh, heroin would have been a better branding over black, black tar, tar heroin? heroin. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. Well, I mean, first of all, I think they were trying to dissuade you from the black tar. They were trying to upsell you to China White. <sighs> Wait, no, but, but black tar was so popular that it was killing people. Well, rich kids too, if I remember correctly. No, nobody preferred black tar. Heroin. Yeah, no, no, it was, it was white suburban kids that were dying of black tar. Heroin. Well, look, as a mm, drug addict, I, mean, I can tell you <laughs> that that was the upsell. No, that was artisanal. <laughs> Hello, friend. Will anyone be at the Seven Acres tomorrow? Uh, I, I'm going to share the whole thing. Yes. Uh, okay. EK's dad is in town, and I would love to show him if possible. By the oh. way, did that happen? That did not happen. Okay. Uh. So you're a liar to boot. I'm a fucking liar. <clears throat> Jesus. Uh, I responded, I think Jeff is staying there for a couple of nights. The, yeah. there is, they stay over here. Do, you, do you have his contact info? Yeah. And, and, he's, and you said, I do not, sir. And, I, and then you followed it up unprodded with, and by the way, you've become my favorite drug. <laughs> yes. <laughs> And then That's also a, a big Kesha stand. Me, yeah. me. <laughs> your love, your love, your love is <laughs> my joy. <laughs> me, no response. Brett, unprompted, <laughs> following up. This week sucks, mostly because I had to convince my team to joke with me. No response. Unprompted follow up. No, because you fucker. <laughs> I to say because you, no, no do I. Bullshit. Yeah. Yeah. That's how. That's how a pusher really operates. Yeah. <laughs> that's a pimp move. Like like like. Oh, I know you. He's making know. your money work Tell for you. Tell me more. Tell oh, me more. Fucker. Tell me more. Tell me more. Because no show for me, grin. Me. Corey's info is blank, <laughs> and his email is blank, <laughs> and I'm honored to be your dealer. Did you happen to hear this week's episode? <laughs> Brett, no. <laughs> He's got something in common with the rest of the population. Well, though I do have, like, I was, uh, I, w- I did listen to some of it, and I did go like, that's what y'all talked about? I wanted to talk about that. <laughs> uh, yeah. Mm, yeah. I was surprised <laughs> you weren't here. I mean, yeah. okay, here, answer this question. Was it a simple bit or not? I, it was not a complicated bit. A very simple no, bit. It was a simple bit. Yeah, okay. It's a very, a very complicated bit. bit. No, I think it's very simple. Explain yeah. the bit. Wait. What? Explain the very simple bit. Uh, the uncomplicated bit. It's nasty. Wait, what are we talking about? Uh, <laughs> oh, somebody, somebody oh, only took the first improv couple of talks oh, and then threw I it away. I was like, what are we talking about? Oh, no, we were talking. It was, what's the... Oh, so we do a podcast on Tuesdays called Thanks. Great Night. Oh, last week. <laughs> <laughs> I, I would like to say that I'm just as uh, forgetful as the rest of you fuckers. All right. We've Am been... I the only person on this couch who actually listened to last week's episode? I mean, I listened, I listened to it. I actually it. did because because <laughs> <laughs> because I was like, was it a complicated bit? <laughs> And then I listen, I'm like, no, this is not a complicated like, bit. It is a complicated bit. I don't think it's that complicated. Explain the bit. He had, the he bit, had the, enough the bit prologue. Was, he the gave a whole was, prologue chapter the to The bit it. was. The bit was. Yeah. yeah very I, simple. I sang tainted love, only oh, I sang yes. tainted blood. Tainted blood because about as vaccines. an anti-vaxxer <laughs> anthem. Okay, so yes, we start right. off with Brian sings a parody <laughs> song, anti-vaxxer <laughs> anthem. Yes. Okay. Just so we know where we're starting out in the very complicated. I'm sorry. Is this part already complicated? Complicated? No. Go, okay. Okay. Go. okay so I'm just not complicated. Know that this we is all where agree. Square not complicated. One. This okay. is. We start at go on on the Monopoly board. Mm-hmm. Sure. Uh, and where do we go? Caitlin Phoenix has it. 
it is complex, but oh, it's not no, complicated. No, 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 Moving on, she yeah. so, <laughs> talked about Moving on. <laughs> yeah, uh, uh, I am bored, Hulk. <laughs> okay, uh, uh, okay, so. Can we talk about you getting gas? Yeah, like yeah, yeah, yeah. So uh, Sunday, we got back from our 48-hour uh, Corpus Christi vacation. Mm. Uh, I, yes. I, I, I'm City I, of Lights. Uh, uh, Crispy Christie. Yeah, uh, Crispy Christie. <laughs> yes. Uh, uh, it was left in the oven too long. Uh, or just enough. <laughs> it's crispy. I shouldn't have said something funny and distracted him. I should have just no. let him keep talking. No, we're no, really, I want to hear good more teammates. about the proper we're good crisping. Teammates. How long in an oven to properly <laughs> to leave, 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 leave a corpus? A corpus, yeah. Uh, leave a corpus. I'd say out of oh. at 400... Yeah. For a hundo. Yeah, but you got to make sure you got to make sure 13, to rub it down with minutes. a little bit of olive oil yeah, and, and a little yeah, salt. Exactly. Just 13, 14 sure. minutes. Or Gordon yeah, Ramsay will crispy. yell at you. Yeah. You donkey! donkey. We went to the aquarium. <laughs> we went as Did on you an do aircraft the Shrek carrier. Donkey? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I feel like he did the Gordon Ramsay yeah. talking, and you went. <laughs> I watched. I watched literally like a million hours of Gordon Ramsay the past month, <laughs> and you went with Shrek Donkey. Okay, don't get. So wait, hold on. Did you accidentally do Shrek Donkey, I or, did Shrek Donkey. or I definitely or were did you Shrek. trying? Were you trying to do Gordon Ramsay, and it just came out as Shrek Donkey? Or did what my Gordon Ramsay <laughs> so surprise you that you're like, I'm going to make a different choice? I'm, that's right. I was flight or fighting, <laughs> and I missed, <laughs> right. and I picked Shrek. Yeah, Mike okay. Myers. Yeah, oh, yeah, that's right. I see that you've is. met past Donkey. <laughs> <laughs> He right. loves parfait. All right. So it's three and a half hours back home. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's right before the Super Bowl. So uh, what looks like a unstoppable, just, you know, straight home. It's going to yeah. be 20 yeah. minutes. It's Clear amazing. Shot. Uh, as we get closer to Super Bowl, you get these testosterone-fueled soccer moms on the highway crashing into each other, hitting the brakes too fast. And and it's like, I got to get off this highway. I don't enjoy the the, up, the speeding up and slowing down. Okay. It's yeah. very complicated with the highway. Right. I don't understand it. This motherfucker thinks it's not very complicated. <laughs> it's I think it's very complicated. <laughs> <laughs> what speed do I go? What direction? I could make a car but i can drive one why are these lines <laughs> everywhere <laughs> so, so you get off the highway we get off the highway because you don't want to deal with these these crazy correct people. Yes. correct and then we realize that oh shit we're literally gonna have to drive past where all the dogs are kenneled and then for uh, like like 30 minutes home and then bonnie's gonna have to get in a car and go 30 minutes back, back for the dogs and then 30 minutes home okay yeah. and and it's like now keep in mind the kids they woke up early in the morning we mm -hmm. went on an aircraft carrier they sat through a bunch of old world war ii shit and and bad productions mm -hmm. so their dad could marvel at the engineering like sure. what uh my by the way my nine-year-old uh kelly says dad i see gray in your beard and i was like yeah and she said you're becoming like a grandpa. <laughs> <laughs> what I like is that Callie speaks like she's on the show Viking. Yes. <laughs> I noticed. Daddy, I would like some carrot. And by the way, to her credit, I was engaging in the most grandpa-like behavior of my entire life. Boomer shit. Yeah, 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 real yeah. boomer shit. Yeah. So, uh, 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 but, but, but you could tell there's this like brittle, everything's about to break. And then we don't tell the kids that like, okay, we're not going to drive past the dogs and then have Bonnie spend an hour. So, how, so, how how crowded is the car? Like, is there, there space for everybody? There, there are five of us and five or six bags in a uh, uh, Honda Pilot. Is is what we're so, driving. So, the, so the, the dogs are gonna have to be in laps and shit like that. It's gonna be yeah. tight, right? And the kids excited are excited dogs, a little bit tired, kids. Yes. not happy. So so we get in and don't know if you know this, Joy, a little bit of energy. Uh, sneakers, a little bit, uh, a corpse that walks. A little, a little bit of life. Of leaves. Yeah, <laughs> a, little, a little bit of life. Yeah, uh, uh, but but we make it home, and it's like you could just you could just feel the tension mm -hmm. of like uh, like everybody like somebody wants to dust up over something, and it's just like, uh, hey guys, ten yards, ten yards mm -hmm. to the finish Come line. On. Let's Come do it. On. Let's do it. Yeah. We cross the finish line, and it's like. Everybody go to your fucking room. Bye, Bonnie. I'm going to the property. I'm going to go get caught up on a whole bunch of work. I'm going to get. I'm going to watch all the shows for court killers because we got so much stuff I got to do tomorrow. Yeah. Go rushing over. You both. <clears throat> Brian, just a burnout. Like, yeah. 
<laughs> Looking like Walton Goggins with yeah. the trailer swinging yeah. with the elixirs. Uh, and then, so, uh, uh, so I come here and it's just like, okay, all I have to do is watch three hours of television <laughs> so that I could talk about it tomorrow, mm -hmm. fill out the doc, yeah. do this other thing and the other thing. And uh, uh, so I start doing the clicky thing. Now, separate fact. Backstory on the property. Anybody watching for any amount of time knows mm -hmm. how challenging the infrastructure has been, where there was some kind of ground loop feedback that 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 would get bad every single day, yeah. and eventually it got internet, so bad. The internet connection internet is spotty. wired up very weirdly here. Correct. In fact, it was so bad that one time in the middle of a broadcast, Comcast, or, uh, yeah, mm -hmm. Spectrum, Spectrum. Spectrum, Spectrum showed up. <laughs> and they're like, why are you here? And they're like, because your signal is so bad here, it's ruining the internet for the neighborhood. <laughs> <laughs> so we would like to shut you down in the middle of your broadcast, right? Yeah. So uh, so uh, I, I, I start running speed tests. Now, we should be getting 600 uh, down and I think uh, 35 up, right? Yeah. Which is enough to do Very what we good. do. Very good. Very good. That's fine. That's sure. it's fine. Very good. Respectable. Respectable. For, we were running you know, a business You could here. bring that kind of up and down home to which your why, Which is why I went business class, you right? Like, yes, because we're running a business. We've got a business here. Yes. Yes. So you are acceptable. That's sorry. The are you doing Cali? I'm doing, I'm doing my Cali, Cali impression. <laughs> yes. You are looking like a grandfather. <laughs> <laughs> so it uh, like some celery stick. <laughs> So it's. Just, I enjoy kindergarten. <laughs> it's just. Do you like blue? I can make blue. <laughs> Dad, father, look at my dance. <laughs> I'm dancing now. It's I'm have dancing. On, have me on your podcast, Dad. <laughs> I would like to be on your podcast, father. <laughs> no, May the gods have your, good fortune your on your podcast, father. Cast, <laughs> father. Is it my birthday today? <laughs> Why not? <laughs> <laughs> What's up? Is someone calling you? Bonnie is texting me weird things right now. Like what? Oh, okay. why are you doing Cali impressions? Quit talking about the kids. <laughs> no, I, Bonnie just texted me out of nowhere. Did you hear the crying? <laughs> Father, did you hear the crying? Did you hear the crying? <laughs> the crying in my head last night. Uh, <laughs> I've seen the future. Put, put a pin in that. It is an ugly I, scene. Th that's Machine a tears flesh. <laughs> that's a developing story. We'll Can come we get back to McDonald's it on the way home? Yes. <laughs> We're telling the story of the moment. I would like a toy in my McDonald's. <laughs> they have Moana. <laughs> <laughs> I'm buckled in. It's like a five minute story. It's like a five minute story. <laughs> you just can't. Sorry. I'm buckled in. Trying Father, to... why do they not talk about Bruno? <laughs> <laughs> He did it again. He's, you're gonna make him vomit again. Don't make him throw up. Because <laughs> no. I'm gonna talk and you're gonna cut me off. No, I won't cut you off. Go. <laughs> you <No>. lying piece of shit. So okay, so I'm but so, so here's what you do. You set me up so I'm fully in the story in the Go! moment. Go! Three, four. <laughs> so uh, 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 okay, so I I, I, I buckle in to watch uh, all the TV stuff that we have to watch for Cord Killers, and it's like stuff's not working, and it's saying there's no connection, and I'm running speed tests. I try multiple computers, and it's like we pay for 600 up down. Uh, I, I hit speed test once. It says 1.2 gigabits, <sighs> and then it says 10 megabits, and then it's it says one point two decide gigabits, what it wants to and make. I'm like the thing, the thing that has plagued us for two and a half years is happening again. Mm -hmm. And the one thing we learned over the last year and a half was you got to catch it in the act because the moment you reset the router, yeah, yeah. it breaks it and it fixes it, and, and you, then you nobody spend can a find long anything time, wrong. Like, documenting this and working with the guy, this right. is not the beginning of our journey. Correct. Uh, and and what it is, it's a ground loop feedback that gets worse over time that creates enough noise that uh, that 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 uh, you know rebooting. Thing, no. fixes it yeah. but yeah, yeah right so uh, uh uh so i call mm -hmm. spectrum business and uh i get somebody uh, won't say his name uh and uh and i and, and but I, make up a name father jimothy 
Glary. 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 Yeah. I call Glary. it, they're like, yeah. Spectrum Business, this is Glary. <laughs> and I say, uh, Glary, you sound like Ryan Reynolds. I, I, I say, <laughs> oh, hi, Glary. Hi, my name is Brian, and I you spout off all the numbers really fast that I know they need because I've done this literally at this point. I don't even think I'm exaggerating. A thousand times. Maybe, maybe 60 to 70 times. So you're, 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 yeah. you are, you are, you are, yeah, you yeah, are yeah. doing the phone tree breaking speed run. Like, speed speed run. run. Yeah, yeah. Here's my name. Here's my Game's birthday. done quick. Go. Yeah. Yeah. Only it's. Uh, yeah. Spectrum edition, right? Yeah. And so I get to the guy, and and then I'm like, uh, "Hey, uh, uh, the thing seems to be happening. Can you check on your end to see whether or not there's an issue?" And and he's like, uh, "Yeah, there's no issue." I was like, "Okay, well, this is usually the part because again, I've done this so many times." Mm -hmm. I said, "This is usually the part where uh, they will uh, uh, escalate or tag the account for some kind of monitoring for the next week. Uh, yeah. I, I forget what you guys call it." Uh, uh, and uh, and he was like, uh, uh, "He said, <laughs> he said." Uh, yeah, that's not a thing. What, oh, what now? And I said, uh, no, I, I've been through this so many times yeah. that eventually you it have, got escalated and you guys ran new copper to the house to yeah. fix it. You had and, the guy's phone number, like uh, personal number. Correct. You like, were talking to a guy specifically about like this Like so many thing. times they came out, the guy said, hey, do us a favor just and call stop me. calling. <laughs> yeah. Jesus. <laughs> because we're just going to come out and reset your router and claim that everything's fine. Yeah. Right. We understand that something is very, very broke. And, and, and eventually it did get fixed, right? Uh, but along the way, there's this thing where there's some kind of a monitoring or in the crazy part is I've already forgotten the term again. But, uh, but, but it's like they would escalate it where basically somebody would monitor your router so they could catch it in the act of doing, yeah. doing the thing, right? Yes. Yeah. Uh, so I describe essentially with um, as much acumen as you just saw th this exact thing to the guy, and the guy goes, uh, "Glary," he says, "Yeah, that's that's not that's not a thing." At which point I say, "All right, Glary, just so we're clear, I suppose it is possible that I experienced this living nightmare again and again for two and a half years." And somehow became confused <laughs> about your process yes. and imagined that this heightened yeah. monitoring was a thing. Mm -hmm. But that seems very unlikely to me. Yeah. And also, you don't want that to be the case, Glary. Exactly. Well, you it, don't it, even. Also, what? also, Father, why are you allowing Glary <laughs> to bar, bear false witness yes. to the Lord? <laughs> and so, and look at so, me do this backflip. You should not let <laughs> Father. Why does Glary have a forked tongue? <laughs> okay, back to back to Glary. All right. So, 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 uh, and then Gl uh, Glary upon. <laughs> Pretty much like that. That's as close as I could get to drawing a line in the sand yeah. without saying it out loud. I'm yeah. saying, motherfucker, are you calling me a liar? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I drew that line. Yeah. And he goes, he's like, well, that must be it because that's not a thing we offer. Wow. Not a thing we offer. It's like, oh, I, so, so this guy did. Is, 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 or, or I said, I said mm -hmm. it, it, you know what? Imagine I said, not a thing you offer or not yeah. a thing you do. Yeah. And he says, it's not a thing we do. Gotcha. Like it was as clear as could yeah. be that he yeah. was calling me a liar and saying, I imagine the whole thing. Yeah. yeah. Uh, at which point I said, I would like my call to be escalated. Yeah. And mm -hmm. This is when like cold fire comes over yes. you. You're like, I would like my call to be escalated. Mm -hmm. And then there's this pause and he's like, uh, he's like, uh, uh, okay, just to be clear, is this about the internet service? And I said, no, no. shithead, it's about the weather. <laughs> Fucking it is about, escalated to God. I said, I said, no, it is about the customer service. Oh, <laughs> wow. you done uh, fucked up, Larry. <laughs> you done fucked you up. You fucked up, Glare. Yeah. Father, so Larry, you have brought Larry is fucked up. The just hell fire. cold fire comes over oh, me, yeah. and he says, well, it'll be a bit. Uh, to which Mother. I said, I will I waste. Oh, don't worry. Uh, yeah. And, uh, and, then you, point, and then then you put him on hold. Like, <laughs> yeah. just, if you like peeing, you come on us. <laughs> and getting caught in the rain. Getting <laughs> gaslit by Glary, <laughs> who has half a brain. By the way, at this point. If you like waiting on the phone call <laughs> until you give me your boss, <laughs> then you can suck my dick, Glary, because I'm getting you fired. Doesn't care that it runs. <laughs> you suck shit. Doesn't care that it runs. <laughs> I was going, where are you going to go and don't care? Yeah, that's fair. That's true fair. to his word. 
Okay, how long did it take? 20 minutes. Ah, All right. You piece of shit. He fucking only waited 20 minutes, and then he had to fucking fold. Uh, uh, oh. uh, yes. Uh, and then at some point, uh, let's just call the other dude. What, 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 is, what is the most awesome name you could think of? Um, Brett. Uh, uh, <laughs> yes. So, so, so sure. you're like, hello, customer service is Brett. And by the way, right now I have a notepad in front of me, and all it says is Glary. Yeah. <laughs> Underlined. With, with jagged, with jagged thoughts. You, take, you, you got your suitcase, you throw your suitcase on the table, you open it up and pull out a ham sandwich. <laughs> oh, I'm ready for this battle, Judge. And so, and so, you know, hello, this is Brett. Uh, first words out of my mouth. I'm sorry, just so I have all of this right for my notes. What was your name? And he's like, Brett. And I'm right, I'm Brett. Okay, okay cool. And I was like, uh, <clears throat> uh, Brett, I have a few questions. Uh, first of all, how extensive are the notes on this account? Do they extend all the way back to the start of my business relationship with your company? Which, and, by the way, great question. Yes. Right? Yeah. That's a great question. Right? Uh, and, and he's like, yes, they go all the way back. I'm like, great. I hear they're legendary and quite expen- extensive. <laughs> <laughs> I, now, all I can do is just imagine that you are a lawyer and, and Brett, the customer service representative, is a judge. And, yeah. now, and now you're just working. You, yeah. are, you are just Tom Cruise in a in, in a few good men, just like so, like, we agree so, that I got. So what notes. you're saying is, dude, okay. So just so we can establish, <laughs> the notes go back all the way to the beginning of the business relationship. Well, why, yes, sir, I do believe they do. Wonderful, wonderful. <laughs> we'll let the record reflect that, right? <clears throat> uh, sec- second question, um, man, I had this crazy thing in my head. I could have sworn that over the last two years, I was escalated to senior technicians. And when they, this problem that kept on happening happened, they would escalate it to, and I forget what they call it, but it was something where somebody would monitor it or they would pay attention to it for a little. And, and the guy says, now, here's the part where I want to go get my notes <laughs> because I don't remember the actual name of it. Uh, but uh, if anybody – Just make up uh, a name. Okay, yeah. whatever. Uh, uh, I, I Monitoring get, too. I, I get this far, far and he's, he's like, uh, oh, yeah, it's called like a, an uh, escalated focus thing, whatever, sure. right? Yeah. And, uh, and, and he says, yeah, we used to offer that for a while. And I was like uh, – Used to. And I, mm-hmm. I, I, mm-hmm. my words, mm-hmm. I was like, yeah. used to, huh? Don't he said, that yeah, anymore, huh? that was the old system, new system like this. It was like, great. Let's talk about Glary. <laughs> you know what? I've had the exact same thing happen to me. When I got, when I got my car uh, a few months ago, right, because uh, uh, of the pandemic, license plates are super slow. They, yeah. When you buy the car, they say you're not going to They get... don't even keep up with your fucking car. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> they lag behind. Yeah. They, they say, like, you're going to have to get another temporary plate because you, plates just aren't coming out that fast. But when I bought the car, they said, we'll pay for it. We got a guy. He goes there and he gets it all. We handle all of it. Uh, time to get a new plate. Oh, no, you have to go. You have to go get it renewed. We don't... We don't do that. You're, we wow. don't do that. Oh. Escalate. And you find out, oh, we had to change the policy. Right. Because they were only giving Glary three plates a day. Oh, and they didn't want to get Glary yelled at consistently. But he couldn't do anything and He couldn't do right. shit. Yeah. So, but, so it, but the guy didn't know. He wouldn't just tell me, like, oh, we don't do that anymore. He was just like, that's not – you're stupid. You have to go do that. So yeah. we, we, like, we get to the part where it's like, okay, let's talk about Glary. Hmm. And I say – kind of Don't talk about Glary. <laughs> <laughs> I begin to barrel forward. I was like, uh, I don't know how long Glary's been with the team. <laughs> I'm but idiot. We're like, just gonna find out whether Glary is a good teammate immediately <laughs> by giving that man permission. Hey, do you want to sell this fucker out? <laughs> yeah. Because I'm gonna give you a perfect reason to sell this fucker I said, out. I don't know how long Glary's been with the team, mm. but uh, team leader to team leader, <laughs> if somebody on my team were to decide to gaslight someone and insist that he had made something up rather than admit he didn't know (laughs) yeah (laughs) i would want to know yeah and uh so i figured you would want to know and then brett says i would (laughs) pause way to go brett 
because I'm pretty sure I know who I'm talking to. Ooh. <gasps> oh. <laughs> the guy that's come here? No. It's just another guy who knows how notoriously bad this account is. He says, he says, I'm pretty sure I know who I'm talking to. You're a legend. And then there was a pause, and I said, then you know how important inter- internet is to me. <laughs> Wait a minute, so he's a fan? Or... Oh, oh no! no! Fucking shit. Brett is a legend. We talked it out. Oh, shit. We decided Glary needs to get bent and yeah. get fixed, Boy. and gaslighting your customers isn't cool. And then we had a conversation about which of the things I do is the most awesome. <laughs> <laughs> so hats off to you, Brett. Yeah. <laughs> and Glary can go. talk about Glary. <laughs> <laughs> can, can oh, I sh- no, no. <laughs> can I share something funny that was said to me? Yeah. Did was, somebody did somebody call you saying like, all right, I don't know how long Brian's been on the job. <laughs> no. So so I was gone in Arizona last week. I was yeah. in the Tucson area. And something that my family Is that in me, New Mexico? That's right by New Mexico. That's right. It's, it's, it's in New Mexico. Little City. New Mexico, yeah. yeah. <laughs> that's right. And uh uh someone in my family had told me that they have like a problem in the Tucson area. Great biking area, lots of bike lanes, huge roads, dedicated turn lanes, big, yeah. of, of very road. So dedicated. Cars. <laughs> like just, just purple hearts on the, <laughs> on the turn lanes. And what someone tells me is, oh, yeah, but we have, we have people who run the red light. We have, red, we have red light runners. What does that mean? It means that they have an outbreak of people who, when the stoplight is at the top position, red, for stop, yeah, will actually ignore it. Yeah. They defy it yeah. and go through the intersection. Now, are we talking about people in cars or people on bikes? In cars. Sorry, real, okay. real quick, this isn't a metaphor, right? Because you're just, just describing, okay, all it's right. It's just... It, it, they, when they told it to me, because they they even have signs. They even have signs that say, "Don't fucking run the red lights, God damn it!" What what is? Don't run the fucking red lights, Brett. Wait, what is happening? Because we also have signs that say, "Don't go faster than fifty five and other signs. Okay, but speed limit signs tell you the limit for that speed. That area, yes, right? yes. This road is fifty five. This, this place just yes. says fucking stop. Well, okay. Every road you don't fucking run red lights. What? That's what? not a problem. You just have bad. You got Hold bad on, wait. people. I, I just heard. Did this you clip. hear all of this? I, I, yeah, I heard most of it, except for the the idea that they are commonly referred to as top lighters. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody's that, been watching too much top, NASCAR, top little light, F, F1. Lighters. No, I know. No, I know. no but is that, is, that just, is that a common thing or is that just a colloquial that I'm, you just came up with? It's just me. I'm just trying to put some spice No, in. I like it. I'm I just really like it. Li- I would love to go like, it's motherfucking Bryce, top lighter lighting. over here. Yeah. Bryce, you have my permission to steal my bit, peel off the mask and go, it me, Glary. <laughs> 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 I don't understand. That's I gaslight you. That's another level. It's not complicated. It's not complicated. Everybody was on board with it. They all, you could tell from the things they're saying. It's simply <laughs> intricate. Okay, and so top lighters. So, so top people, lighters. So, people but, but in Arizona is, run red lights. They run red lights or in the Tucson area. I don't know the exact details. But, okay, but, Tucson, but, but yeah. It's, it's, because, that, because I always heard also mm. that uh, Phoenix and the Phoenix surrounding areas are mm. notorious for overactive traffic cops that like there's like a really high DUI percentage out there. there's a really, oh, really? high speed uh, speeding ticket percentage out there because mm-hmm. they ASU I guess is such a party school that they will just pull over yeah. anybody that's doing anything because there's a fair chance that you they're going to get pop for something yeah. uh, but but this is Tucson so they are they are just like people are just <laughs> deciding the not r- to obey the, the laws the law. of- yeah I mean it's not like it, it, it's it's different from a speed limit, right? Like the right. speed limit changes. Yeah. The red light means it's pretty much we all know. know what it means. Yeah. So is this something you witnessed? I thankfully didn't witness it because apparently it's like 
I mean, obviously it's dangerous, but these are people doing it at dangerous times, right. getting people hurt. Yeah. Uh, uh, but I, I thankfully did not have experience that. D uh, is this a shared experience where you are pretty sure you're going to make yellow, but then very clearly it's it turns red before you get through? Sure. And then you tense up and then you like, notice uh, that somebody behind you kept going? Yeah. That and I do that. I will run a yellow. Or... <laughs> if, you're, if you're in the... Oh. Father, why do you employ a top lighter? <laughs> I hear he runs yellows. <laughs> <laughs> As you know, we have been at war with them for many a year with the top lighters. Would you employ such a to person? To hell with the top lighters. <laughs> top lighters shall never top yellow. Top lighters are our sworn enemy, Father. Why would you consort with one? Father, I must tell you, I am dating a top lighter now. <laughs> <laughs> well, so, so you know, he don't, he would be, you know he would be, if he's running yellows, he's a middle lighter. Yeah, yeah you're allowed to be a middle. He's lighter. a middle lighter. My understanding is these are people who have like <laughs> stopped at a red light and decided, no, I'm just gonna go Fuck that. and then go. Okay, but so, but, so, so they're just saying that stop lights are stop signs, like that 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 they can just stop for a second and then fuck off. If, if that follow up that, question, Tucson, <laughs> viewers and listeners, if you are listening, then please where are they emailing? Uh, wait, great night, you, Joe Walsh. Great, uh, wait, great Joe night, Walsh pod. Uh, uh, who am I now? <laughs> Adam Walsh. Uh, yeah, Adam what's, Walsh. Uh, uh, what's his dad's name? Free America's Fallen. Most Wanted. Yeah. Uh, no, it's Tom Petty. Free yeah. Uh, uh, Wait, uh, his name also everybody Joe at the no, Hotel Adam California. <laughs> no, Adam I'm, the, guy. I'm yes. the Beatles guy. That's right. Wait, no, the Eagles guy. Let it be. Anyway, if you're from Tucson, so, tell us about this. So someone red please explain this in, because because this is a thing. I saw a lot of signs for it. I get it, but it's just it's not like you're doing too much. You're not supposed to do it at all. I really right. love that you idea shouldn't. though of of like. All of these laws are are just because we have agreed to silently to all stop oh at these lights sure. and not. There's Social no contact. reason why we cannot just all of a sudden be like, like, oh, like that's man's law. Yeah, God's law says I can do whatever the fuck I want. Colors don't fucking uh, uh, judge me. Like I'll, I'll run that shit. Interesting. Well, uh, Interesting uh, that is an amazing shredding of anarchy <laughs> of of like civil but society. So, so my question with the the light is, yeah. is it that they they just blow through they the light. Blow through it and they, they blow okay. through it so much that people. somebody somewhere has to spend like a hundred dollars on a sign to say, "Hey, Don't you obey you those laws." That. Hey, yeah. buddy. Right. Hey, buddy. Hey, hey uh, Mister. What? Where I was trying to head was oh. I recently had a yellow light that turned into a red light, and I felt really bad as I crossed the red light, yeah. and I saw there was a car behind me that was also running it, but it was farther behind me. I had that today. It was a school bus. <laughs> <laughs> oh. They're allowed to do that. They're allowed to do that. They're allowed. They're, they're allowed, allowed to do top that. light. Really? Yeah. 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 It's a school bus. Because they're big and yellow. If your Jeep is big and yellow, you get to do it too. Middle kids, light. Kids are kids are uh -huh. made of kids are made yellow of light. Okay. Made so of if they, if they hit the school bus, they'll just bounce. It tracks. It tracks. Right. Bouncy, yeah. fancy, fun, 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 fun. <laughs> That's right. Yeah. Father, my school bus was in an accident. <laughs> I'm uh, quite fine though. Hey, I got a question. Yeah. Uh, has Sign reached out to Corey yet to get me booked on his show? <laughs> Told he did. You want to push this down the road? Well, I want to be on his show. I, 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 Take I, five minutes. I want Thank to be on his show so bad that I refuse to be on his show long enough that he would commission a song to embarrass me for not being on his show. Sure. And now finally I got to be on the show. And all of a sudden I'm not, I, I don't see no invites in my inbox. So you wanted to email you, not Corey? No. <laughs> you wanted to email Corey? Yes. And then have Corey email you? Yes. <laughs> I'm fucking yeah. I'm running yellows here. Yeah, middle week, <laughs> middle middle light, middle lighters, middle lighters. That's right, <laughs> middle lighters as an NBC sitcom, right after Wings, yeah. or, or or like a a really cheap beer. <laughs> yeah, it's middle light. I mean, it has some weight. <laughs> we'll it. never get to the regatta at this speed. <laughs> okay. Middle lighters. Hey, I'm the middle lighters blimp. I just pooped out a bunch of beer for you. <laughs> bing, 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 bing. Thank bing, you, bing, middle lighter. And here's a lady. <laughs> <laughs> we'll have sex hey, when we get to the regatta. Man, 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 man. Hold on. Middle lighter. <laughs> Wait, real quick. Did you mean to say regatta or did you mean ramada? Uh, regatta. <laughs> regatta. Yeah. At the boat race. Yeah. Okay. Because that's where they're headed. Okay. 
Okay. I mean, otherwise, it's just two guys going to a hotel room. <laughs> that's weird already. That's, yeah, that's a whole different thing for the, an 80s beer commercial. <laughs> Wouldn't that be a great... We'll never oh get God. to the Ramada at this speed. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. Like, Imagine with that. two shifty-eyed guys <laughs> meeting up at a Ramada. The music swells in the shadowy area. And all of a sudden, they open the door, and there's, uh, I don't know, Adam Sandler. And he's like, uh, he's like sorry, bros, this is for me. Middle lighters only, and yeah. then uh, ba -da 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 yeah. Da -da -da all of a sudden da -da -da. it's all patent leather and dogs playing poker, yeah, and, yeah, like, yeah. all that shit, and, and and fourteen bodacious Swedish bikini team babes, yeah, fucking, fucking glary, glary. Don't gaslight me. Well, I mean that's fuck why glary. Guys oh, like Brad. You, think, you think Glary got fired? No, but, but I hope he did. Oh, by the way, there is so much power. That phrasing, I I, I mean, look, not to pat myself on the back, but oh, that phrasing like of like, hey man. Team leader, team leader. If yeah. somebody on my team did this, uh -huh. I'd want to know about it. Yeah. What do you think? And he said, I think you're cool, and I've been watching your show since it was scam school. <laughs> 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 so was he in – was he local, or, or was that a call center somewhere? Call right? center yeah, somewhere, so right? right. So but, but, but again, it's, it's, it's a bit like – I remember asking Alex Albrecht uh, when, uh, if he gets recognized, and he just turned to me and said – Best Buy. <laughs> like, like there's certain places where, you know, like, like apparently Apple as store. I was, Apple as, store. as Apple we were store going through, the best. you might, you might find yourself I, at an Apple store. I think day. I would. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, but, so as we went through stuff, oh, I mean for podcasting specifically, like oh, okay. podcasting specifically, like Apple stores, I've been in line for an iPhone and somebody was like, Thought I recognized your voice. No, like it's by far, and it, it is like being famous at one chain, and also it's a chain where you also get to spend several hundred dollars. Uh, so you also look rich. It's the best shit ever. By the way, we did a pub trivia night last Wednesday, and uh, 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 Andrew Heaton showed up uh, uh, a little bit after most of us, and he came up while I was in line at the bar for like a second lap of drinks or whatever. And, uh, and, and he showed up just in time for the bartender to say like, Hey, are you? And I'm like, yeah, I'm the guy. And then, uh, and, and Andrew Heaton was like, uh, man, I only get recognized at polling places or whatever. And I was like, yeah, pro tip. <laughs> Get famous for being in a place where you're already going to be, and then you get recognized <laughs> there. <laughs> uh, all right, I'm gonna, I was going to say something about Heaton, but that's a private thing. Okay. Mm. Uh, uh, it's time. Is it's it time. time to leave? It's time. Hey. Mission Control, Mission Control. Glary, are you there? Yes, Don't I'm call here. him in, Glary. I'm here. Okay, get fucked. I want to <laughs> talk to your supervisor. <laughs> okay, Where's one second. Where's Brett? Bring him out. Uh, all right. Uh, uh, oh, uh, uh, what? Yes, supervisor here. Goodbye. Oh, <laughs> oh, there Shit, are we, no, are we still going? No, they, oh, I think you wanted well, to talk to my supervisor, Corey Cranfield. No, he, he turned <laughs> into <is>. himself. <laughs> I thought I was taking the cue. <laughs> okay, I see. I, I, I see. Take it away, Mr. Control. You're, you're uh, all fired. Uh, uh, so you're, long, we're gentlemen. We're all fired. All right. Thank you, everybody. Thank you. Uh, by the way, Walter Mondale was robbed. <laughs> Happy Tuesday, everybody. Wink. Wink you. Mm. Wink you? Wink you for joining us? Well, that's, that's not a thing. That's not that, a thing. It feels like a thing. I feel it's almost something. Mm -hmm. Definitely not a thing. Hello, everybody. Thank you for joining us here in the green room, great room, pre-show thing. Bryce and Steel. Got Corey Granville here. Hey, what's up, everybody? And do some birthdays with me? I do. We got a couple of birthdays here. Uh, let's see. Starting from Nero, I believe. Uh, uh, Nero's partner, Dasha. And then uh, Norby, their birthdays were both this month. Uh, on the 4th, she turned 22. On the 25th, he turned... Oh, no, he turned 25 on the 10th. That's not confusing at all. Greetings from Hungary and Russia. Hello. Yes, it was you were hungry my wife's birthday. Oh, happy birthday. Je uh, uh, I almost asked how old she turned because I've been around children all... I don't even... I have no idea. It's, good, it's better to not ask, yes. I think. Um, well, happy birthday to Jen. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, we've also got Bobcat, whose birthday was yesterday. Happy birthday, Bobcat. Uh, we've also got, let's see, uh, Russell, uh, uh, Lottie's husband, Russell. Happy birthday on the 12th. Happy birthday. Uh, Bramerica also had their birthday yesterday. Happy birthday, Bramerica. And Scooper Nova Girl, our friend, favorite friend of the show. Do you ever think? It's on Friday. 
Do you ever think that, uh, like, when we have like a big chunk of birthdays during like one week, mm-hmm. you always like look back nine months to see what was happening that time of year. Oh, you know, it's always like, is that like, is that, is that Valentine's July? Day? Is that yeah? Yeah. So like, I don't have to a VJ that. Day. Uh, is that uh? What's what was happening that a, day? A Bastille, the original Bastille Day, something like that. Yeah. yeah. Um. Uh oh, and Captain Fubar also on the 18th. Happy birthday, Captain Fubar! You got it in, just in the nick of time. Ooh, Happy birthday, of course. Captain Fubar. Um, well, uh, uh, we've got a few minutes here before we uh, start the Great Night program. Would you like to do a little critical racing theory? I do. I'm so excited. I'm, I'm guessing you've you've got something. Uh, and I used to, but John did. cleaned up, and I oh. think that means he got rid of the thing that I had. So we'll do that. Uh, we'll do that another time. We have plenty of time before the season starts, so we won't do any rankings today. We do. Um, but we have a lot to. We have plenty to talk about. We do. Because the teams have started showing off their new cars for the new year. What do you think of McLaren? We got to start off with your oh with McLaren. I you know I, I and I am a McLaren head. Do you like that blue in there? I like it. Yeah, it yeah. it looks a lot um, and not uh, you know n- not by accident. It looks a lot like the the famous Gulf livery with yep. the orange and blue that they do. Exactly. Uh, the glow in the dark color also looks really cool. Yeah. Um, yeah, so McLaren is a just a straight up orange, really. Yeah. A really nice orange. And then they usually have orange and silver. Um, mm-hmm. They were primarily silver a decade ago. Yeah, exactly, right, with a little bit of orange. Now they're mostly orange with a little bit of silver, but this year they added in a big stripe. A of, big blue accent. Yeah, big blue accent, and it goes very nice with that orange. Oh, yeah. And they they've also they're working in black as as well, which I think it looks good. I think it, it, it is a good. I think it's a safe. Yep. I think it's a safe livery, and I hope that they do more one offs because yep. they they do really good one offs, mm-hmm. and uh, I think that's the game that they're the, playing this season. The real concern is now your hat is trash. No. <laughs> it is it, no, it's ineffective. You don't even know what team that is for. <laughs> it's just a different vintage. <laughs> I think it looks okay. Well, yeah, um, what did you think about Aston Martin? Aston Martin uh, also showed off a real car. Yes. And uh, uh, Aston Martin getting a highlighter yellow accent color. Yep. Highlighter yellow. Uh, really, the colors on that one didn't really it's, matter to me tremendously. Yeah. Uh, I was more intrigued with their louvers. Their louvers? Yeah, I'm a little bit more of the interested in what they're doing with the shape of the bodies. Mm. So, uh, like the uh, Aston Martin compared to the uh, McLaren. The McLarens get real skinny in the back mm-hmm. um, versus the uh, Aston Martins actually carry a lot of the body width down. Uh, see, yeah, you see it, the it's, uh, louvers there? It, it, yeah. In fact, I, I like these little grills. I think that this is really cool. They have these on the Alpha Tari car that was shown off today or yesterday. Yep. And I think that's cool. I think seeing those grills is really cool. Yeah, it is. And I think it's been really nice to see across. They've got four or five cars have come out. Two or three of them are actual cars. Yeah. Um, I like seeing those grills. Yeah. And I like seeing all of the very different body shapes. It makes me think that uh, the teams there will... Has, there's a chance to be wild. Yeah. A chance to be wild. The teams can can start very separated yep. this season. Um, and they'll catch up. They'll yeah, all catch up. Yeah, but it'll, it'll be... Uh, several cars will be trash, and then we will have to totally redesign their car real quick. Yeah. Um, do you have a favorite of the cars that have been shown off so far? Uh, the McLaren looks looks, looks sick, but the uh, Alpha mm. actually looked pretty solid too. It was yeah, you know. I always like the look of their cars. I like the gray, the the two tone yeah. gray look. I didn't like their like hype video. Oh, it I, felt yeah. You know, Alpha Tari is supposed to be a fashion brand. Yeah. It's Red Bull's fashion mm-hmm. brand, mm-hmm. or whatever that means. But I, I, it always feels very unfashionable to me. Yeah, I did like like the designs on the cars. Like they had a lot of bunch, had a, uh, a nice looking swoosh across the uh, front wing. Yeah. Let me see if I can pull that up here. Um, it looked pretty solid. Mm. And I like the way the just like the, the, the uh, graphics of the car looked pretty good. Yeah. And there's there's a lot of uh, long noses, a lot of uh, thin noses as far as I can tell from some of the cars that have popped out already. Yeah. So here's them trying to, like, they don't look cool. Like, if so serious. Yeah. I'm a racer. But, uh, uh, yeah, it's uh, I I like for if you're gonna have the same simple kind of look over and over again, mm-hmm. I like what AlphaTauri is doing more than Red Bull. Yeah, with Red Bull just literally using the same <laughs> same design. Yeah, 
um, over and over again. Yeah. Which is fine. Pick something and stick with it. Yeah. But I, I'm still excited to see what Ferrari does because Ferrari usually does some pretty cool stuff. Yeah. Um, uh, uh, Mercedes will be coming out soon yeah. too. I think. I think most everything. You think there's going to be black again? Oh yeah. Uh, uh, no, I think. I think that they're gonna well i don't know go back to the silver bullets they were gonna make a hull they had made hullabaloo that they were gonna go back to silver this mm. year but i wonder starting over is not the bad guys yeah well i don't know they they picked black because of at uh, lewis hamilton's urging because of the the, the george floyd yep. in response to the george floyd stuff um and so that they've they've been very upfront like that this is temporary we've decided to do this for two years and so unless they are going to adopt black as their new team color. Mm -hmm. They're going to be silver in 2022. That'd be nice. But what do I know? I don't know. Oh, yeah. Sure. Uh, Haas cars look. Oh, okay. yeah. They looked all right. Yeah, it's fine. It's a Russian flag. Very, and... very uninspiring. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it didn't seem like it had. It seemed like the other cars that we've seen always had like one thing about them, whether it's the grills. Yeah. A, lot of, a lot of talk is about the suspension, which is true. I think the Haas has also got some. Uh, funky suspension stuff going on this year, but otherwise Quick rod versus pull rod suspension. Yeah, and I would love to watch. I'm sure F1 will have a video about yeah. what the different suspensions mean. Yeah, but um, yeah, I watched. Yeah. I can send it to you. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Nuclear Canary says I do miss rooting for that Ooh, Ferrari. Canary, that's red. my brother. Hey. Oh, hi, that's Michael. Uh, says yeah, I do right. miss rooting for that Ferrari red. You know, supposedly they're saying Ferrari's gonna have a new red. They're gonna have a dark red. Uh, yeah, I love their dark red stuff. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it'll be a little lighter than this maroon yeah. shirt that you're wearing now. Yeah. It is dark red. Mm -hmm. um, it'll be interesting to see. I like, I like the, like the fire engine. Yeah, red, I like Ferrari the pop. Red. I just like the yeah. pop of it. That's why I like McLaren too. Because I like the accents. I like it when they do that red plus the dark red. Uh, yeah, something about that makes me happy. Yeah, and that's why all the mission window stuff was annoying. Because if they did a color, it would be green. I never could read that. I mean, it's it's all it's all smoking. I, it looked like it was like mission upside down or something. Oh right, because winnow is not a word, and yeah. it does look like mission being reflected. Yeah, I don't know. I, every time I looked at it, I was like, I guess that's just a riff. I don't know what I'm supposed to get there. Yeah, and it's excuse me, and it's just vapes. Yeah, it's just Philip Morris saying, "Hey, we can't sell you Marlboros, so we're just going to remind you we do vapes." Yep. Okay. <laughs> Ferraris. Ferraris had. I don't know if questionable sponsors is the right uh, term for it, but they've had yeah. cigarettes as their sponsor forever. Yeah. And like, you know, we were talking about McLaren. They have a big Velo sponsor on top of their F1 car, which is a vape, I think, as well. Um, you know, playing... Uh, oh, my gosh. Okay. By the way, just if you can hear my voice, if you see a PlayStation 5 controller in this house, it might be mine, and I've been looking for it for three weeks. I told you what happened to it. <laughs> <laughs> you I noticed you didn't respond to it on <laughs> Twitter. Well, you tell the people what what happened to me. Uh, so you lost your controller, uh -huh. right? Yes. And I said, "Oh, the PlayStation curse got him. I got him again." What curse? What yeah. curse? I Obviously, you just found out what curse. That's <laughs> what you get for buying a PlayStation instead of an Xbox. Um, you know how <laughs> my ex mm -hmm. see my mm -hmm. house? I I am filthy with Xbox controllers. I've, sure. I've, I've got, got one, four of I've them. Got me and my daughter in my house, and we've got at least thirty-seven controllers. Like they just <laughs> multiply in there, man. Yeah. Look, look, look. It has nothing to do with me working for them for fifteen years. <laughs> nothing to do with that. I almost they I almost went out and bought a new controller because they've got new colors out for the PlayStation. They've got black yeah. and wine yeah, and you blue. That hat was expensive. <laughs> <laughs> they are like sixty or seventy bucks, <laughs> but they. They were cheaper than I thought they would be because they are cheaper than the uh, Pro, Pro Controller, yeah. the Nintendo Pro Controller, which is not worth being $90. Uh, no. no. Not what it is. It's good, but it's not worth that money. Does, does PlayStation have a, a have Pro a Controller? Pro? No, they just did the back triggers, okay. but I don't uh, I don't think they do a separate better, a Pro and Controller. And once you touch an Xbox Elite Controller, it's now nice. They are the Elite is nice. But once you touch it, you're like, nope, never touching another controller. Yeah, it, and you know, I part of the reason, I don't know, like the Xbox controllers are great. I use them when I play on the PC, but yep. I need to keep, I, I want to use my PlayStation more, um, and so it's been a bummer. I think I don't know, so I don't know where it is, and I don't know where I lost it. I assumed I lost it here in the studio because it was right after Back to the Future mm -hmm. when I lost it, and um, but I I don't see it, and but. Things move here. Things mm -hmm. move around in here. Yeah, so. really. I haven't noticed. <laughs> so hopefully, 
Hopefully that pops up. Anyway, so playing Gran Turismo, okay. they have a livery. Um, oh, is that like Forza, but it's not quite as good? Exactly. Okay, cool. And um, a lot of the liveries that they that people make on there, like on Forza, people make really cool liveries. Yeah. They make fun stuff. They'll just do animes and movies mm -hmm. and all sorts of ties up. And they don't do that as much with Gran Turismo because their livery stuff is still pretty new. Yeah. But what they do a lot of is, or what I see a lot of is... Uh, people mimicking uh, real cars and sponsors mm -hmm, and stuff. Mm -hmm. And after a while, you kind of, you're, it's kind of like a magic eye painting where you kind of see beyond oh, it. You're like, yeah. okay, yeah, there's a bunch of logos and stuff everywhere, but look, look at the color. They got the golf colors. Oh, they got the Ferrari red. So, mm -hmm. uh, yeah, so yeah, there's, there's, you, there's a little bit of a hurdle, yeah. but once you get past it, then you do kind of the, 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 Philip Morris's and the Marble Rose kind of wash away a little. Mm -hmm. yeah. Um, alrighty, people are making their way inside. Hello. Uh, uh, so thank you, Corey, for joining me here. Hugs and kisses for some critical racing theory. Thank you, everybody, for listening to the Great Night Green Room Great Room Pre-Show Mini Podcast thing. I would love. I we need to find. I love to do more of these mini podcasts. Is mini podcast is a good idea? I think the mini podcast is a good idea. But the number of people I get tweets about not liking it is maybe a little high. So let's all. Hey, great is lobster. But then, but then suddenly yeah, yeah. somebody shows up with a. He calls it a bill. I'm like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. That's weird. Good, can't we just all have lobster here? It's me, Glenny. Definitely wasn't a cry for help by Bryce to have people <laughs> defended on Twitter either. Yeah. There's you know what? It's me, uh, anti Glenny. I yeah. say double the bill. Oh, right. I'm, I'm oh. pro Glenny. Right. Glenny's the my new Christ. <laughs> <laughs> Glenny is my new Christ. Hey, can so uh, there's a can someone can, can someone bring me my cider on that stool fight <laughs> on the stage? I kind of like I like, I like, I like the here. mid crossfade just <laughs> leaving it halfway between the two of us. So, <laughs> thank you very much. I mean, it ended up over there because I was doing I was messing actually, with the camera. I kind of love the idea that like uh, your CNNs, your CNBCs, your Fox News is they don't do the split screen anymore. They just do this. This is how they conduct their interview. Is uh, yeah. hello, welcome to and Ghost. That's to where Ghost. you're wrong, Doug. <laughs> hey man, look you and me. Oh wait, when you talk that way, it looks like I'm talking. Hey, uh, now Bryce. Is just nah. behind us what? for fucking whatever reason. Real, real, real Glenny. All righty, everybody. Thank you so much. We still got people who are out there getting drinks and snacks and stuff, so we're giving them some time. Uh, thank you, everyone, for joining us here in the Green Room Great Room pre-show. If you want to support this, um, if, if if you want to support this, patreon.com slash great night. Uh, I'm, so, I'm sorry. Can we talk about the we, tone? Why are we you're adopting yeah. right here? What's We're trying uh, to get the show started. <laughs> uh, look, okay, I'm sorry. Uh, uh, court reporter. This. <laughs> yeah, uh, okay, <clears throat> let's play back the recording. If you want to support this, uh, if you want to support this. Uh, that's editorializing from Bruce? the... <laughs> <laughs> hey, Bruce. Hey, Bruce. Bryce, Bryce. All righty. Hello. <laughs> okay, Justin got it. Justin got Bryce, Bryce. All right, everybody. Hello. And uh, Patreon.com slash great night. <laughs> going great. Patreon.com slash great night is where you can support this and all sorts of great stuff, including a bonus episode every week. How many times a month? No one knows, but it's every week. <laughs> all right. I have got all my stuff here. Let me ask all of you. You're sloppy. Yeah, on the case. Sloppy. All right. Uh, uh, Brett, are you good? Hello, friend. Hello, friend. Corey, are you good? Yeah. Annalisa. I'm good. Justin and Brian. Yeah, you yeah, All of our folks watching. Woo! Everybody's good. All right. Brett, I'm going to count you in. Thank you. Uh, in uh, 